hello hello everyone welcome back to my channel it is another weekend it is saturday the 13th of july now i'm not really too sure what i'm get, going to get up to this weekend but i know that this afternoon i am off to the board game club to play some games with some friends um i've got up got dressed had a shower washed my hair had my breakfast already um and i'm just watching Disney Plus, Station 19 on Disney Plus. So yeah, let's finish this episode and then see what I do before lunch because it's about 11 o'clock right now. And just got my lunch guys, so it's literally my breakfast, but it's my lunch. So I haven't really got anything else in, but um, I haven't got any sweet chili sauce, so I've gone for ketchup. And then I'm just going to watch a little bit of Station 19 again on Disney+. Plus. Right, a little plant update today, guys. It is currently raining. It's not the best weather. But um, we're off to the board game club soon. So let's do this now. So my carrots are actually coming along pretty well. Like... Um, you can actually see like, you know, there there are carrots in there. Can you see that? Which is like so exciting. There's one. Oh, there's another one there. Look at it. Oh, and then obviously, you know, the onions as well. Oh, can you see the onion? Yeah. And then that big one over there. Amazing. Obviously, that's still got a bit to go to get the bright orange colour. But they are coming along so, so well. Um, Stuart's mum came over earlier and she helped me cane these tomato plants up because they were just like getting so big and like drooping everywhere. So yeah, and they've actually got like flowers on them now. So hopefully they'll produce loads and loads of tomatoes. These have started to flower as well. These are sweet, sweet red peppers. So that's very exciting. Um, and then pan around. These, my tomato plants, these are looking amazing. They're also starting to flower. So hopefully these will produce loads and loads of tomatoes. It just looks like a bush to be fair. But hopefully they'll have tomatoes on them. And then down here, it's very, very slippery. Um, so got some more peas, got some more tomatoes, um, and hopefully these will produce, oh my god, don't know what that was, um, these aren't looking too great, but this one is, this one's looking good, that one's looking good, that one's looking good, there's obviously some more peas here, that's probably, um, ready to come off. I think that's nearly ready. Um, and then some more sweet red peppers. And then I still don't know what the hell this is. But it has like little cute white flowers on them. Does anyone know what this is? The berries or whatever, these little things, are not getting any bigger. So I, I don't know what it is. It might be a weed. But who knows. Oh. And then my cucumbers. So I think I've got three here, which are looking amazing. And then just two over here. That one's dead, I need to take that out. But um, yeah, that one's looking so, so good. And then a, another little one. And then hopefully um, that will come of something, maybe. You never know. Um, and then more sweet red peppers over here so yeah that is the update guys and now i'm gonna go because i'm getting wet <laughs> i am getting soaked did not think it was going going to be this rainy it's july how is it like why is it raining why the hell is it raining but anyway let's get in because i'm getting wet
So I'm going to keep the water where it is. So that's going to advance by one. And turn this twice, yeah? Yes. So one, two. Yep. Yeah. Uh, it doesn't really matter. Um, I think I'm going to spend the two coins to get that one. Um, I also yep. take it. There you go. Okay. And I don't Stop really action. know where to put this. Let's put it there. Yep. Right, so, so I am going to do a one movement action and then 22 yeah. for each for red. Spend two coins green. to do the thing. Yep. Yeah. And I get another one. 71. So, so come on, that token, one. Yes, token, I can plant three anything. pebbles. Uh, blue, you can also worth three so inch. Two, one. six. Can I get a point? If you wish. Please, uh, and, and, another, and another dig, which is going to be oh, a white. Uh, and get a coin. And then I'll this. That's the first yeah. movement. And the second movement is going to be over here. And I'm going to get a purple, a dark purple. So four cents, 28. And you get me on 99. And then I get another one. Yep, here. Eight points for purple. And I will dig a Four points for green. Yep. And I get one of those. Yeah. You probably want to take a hill, that's it. Oh, definitely. Uh, red tokens. Uh, red player, they're worth one each. Two. Green player, worth one so each. So let's get that one. Give me that one. Can I get yeah. three more points? Uh, drop it down to one. Get anything short in your bag? Mm. <laughs> no, question. And I'm going to do that one. So that gets you. So that's three coins. Yeah. And then a. Scout or see something. Uh, I think I've got one of these. Yeah. That's 30 minutes, trick taking. Oh, but I can't put any of them in there. You've got anything? Um, I, I, I yeah. want a, like, one of these, so I can get the six points. Right. So I can go there. Uh, should. I could go there. Yeah. over there. You could. But I can't go up there. 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 I know. I think I can't hold it. Can you talk? I wanted to go there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, well, you can put it on the edition. Yeah. Uh, so, so, True, yeah. So, so I'll go here, because that's legal. I guess I'll three coins. So, do you want to drop this first of all? Yeah. So you've got two drops of this, and I can get two coins or two points, or one on one? One on one. Uh, contract? Sure um, person? Two play. Yeah. Um, can you overwrite contract with more yes. contracts? I thought you, you can, but you don't get the points again. again. Yeah. What's that eye symbol? Uh, it means when you Can't get one of these, you can take the uh, four. Three from these. And choose which one you want to. Yeah. So you can take what's on there plus three extra ones, oh. and choose which one you want to keep. Oh. Quite helpful. More helpful. Uh, no, the no, no. Yeah, we're getting towards the end. No. Uh, and what's the second one? Uh, whenever you take the market action, you get to get at all. And the last one is when you take the boat action, you get two points. Oh, I'll take that one because I'm going to take the market action. And I'll get you six points. Uh, six points, pay for red. Okay. So on top of orange. Yep, so you're in a joint lead. Oh, I've got no points. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not end game scoring, you've already caught me up. Um, and then, what, 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 um, where, am I, where am I? Here. So I've done that, yeah? I've done that. Yeah, so good. And now, market. market. Do you want to spend coin? So I will. So I'm going to spend 18 pounds. Did you want to spend another coin to put the uh, okay, neutral market in that spot as well? So, what colour do you want to spend? What, so I can get three? Yeah, we're going to turn it off. We're going to cost you a coin to do it. Erm. Green's near it. No. I'll just get two white. Do we need it? I'll get a contrast. How can you sell off about? And then, is that me done? I think so. Um, yeah, I think I've done everything that I wanted to do. Cool. Well, that's so, right. Yeah, I've done that. Taking oh, and then, on trade, market, I get tool. So, yes. Oh, and then place. I've put a windmill out, so and I get tool. Who's different about this? Yes. You've got both out first. No. No, but I don't think I've used that. Never mind. No, I haven't forgotten to do that. I haven't forgotten to do that. I've definitely forgotten to do that. So, head is on 107. Steve's on 120, I'm on 122. So, okay, romp tip for 148. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> That's cool. I'm I like that. Right. <laughs> okay. I'm off today. Right, 
back from the board game club now guys i played a total of i think four games we played a game of sioro which i did badly at <laughs> it's one where you get like three tiles and you put a tile out and you move your little marker and you're trying to stay on the board but i well actually from my actions i did stay on the board but with other people um I just had to come off the board because of the tile that they placed. We then played a game called Windmill Fally and I actually really enjoyed that. I got like a really good good like combo going. Um and yeah, I think I got it and I think like that's like when I know I like a game. And I, I actually came first guys, like you know, can anyone believe it? What the hell? <laughs> Um, and then we played a game of Far Away. I don't do too badly at that. Um, it is like a bit of mind boggling when you're playing cards out and you're not actually going to be scoring anything on that card until like late, like, you know, um, at the end. Um, so yeah, it's a bit mind boggling like which side to put cards on. Um, and then we played a game of Potato Man, which is like a very quick sort of betting game, I guess, to get sacks of potatoes. You win a trick and you get a sack of potatoes and you get um, you have to get so many sacks to win, like, you know, most points wins, most sacks of potatoes wins. Um, but yeah, I think now... It's really rubbish weather, it's so bad out there. But we have just ordered a Chinese um, because we've literally got no food in. So yeah, having a Saturday, Saturday night takeaway. Yummy. So we've gone for a Chinese tonight for our dinner. So I've got the chicken and pineapple, chicken fried rice with chips. A glass of Baileys, here's my leftovers, and then we're watching Hunchback of Notre Dame. Look at that. And it is now Sunday morning, it is Sunday the 14th of July. After our takeaway, our Chinese takeaway last night, we finished off The Hunchback of Notre Dame. That was actually like a really good film, like I don't normally what like go and watch that film but um i did really enjoy it it's probably underrated for what it is like I, f I do feel like there should be more merch and more um more things about it around but yeah it was good and then i came upstairs and i read a little bit more of my book well i started my book and read about maybe 60 pages this is what I'm reading at the minute. It's the Terry Pratchett Equal Rights. Now, this is actually like, I'm actually really enjoying this, like more than the first two books. It's about a wizard who um, is going to die, but he has to hand his staff to the eighth son of an eighth son. Um, but then he realizes that the eighth son doesn't have an eighth son. He has, an, he, he has a daughter, but he, I, they don't realise that until after they've handed the staff over. And apparently girls don't become wizards, they become witches in the Discworld novels. So, yeah. But anyway, <laughs> I'll, I'll probably um, read some more of that today, maybe tonight when um, I'm getting ready for bed. But it's now food shop time, so we're going to Asda now to get our food shop. Before we head to Asda, I had to actually make a list of like the meals that I'm having this week. And I'm, uh, I'm going to be baking this week because my dad is coming um, to Grimsby for a few days. So, And he hasn't had any of my baking for ages. But... Um, these are the recipes that I've, I've got this week, so chicken chow mein, pizza pasta, 
and sausage casserole. I think I'm going to do that tonight because it takes five hours in the slow cooker. I do have a slow cooker, so um, yeah, I'm going to do them. And then the baking bits um, is mint chocolate cupcakes. Now these recipes are from this recipe book, Pinch of Nom Quick and Easy. And then the cupcakes are from Jane Patisserie's Everyday Book. So yeah, let's head to Asda. Right, back from Asda now. I've got the bags here. So let's see what we got this week. So to start off with, I've got some celery sticks. Some pepperoni for the pizza pasta that I'm going to do. Some baby potatoes, which I've got another pack. I'm not, sh I'm not sure where that is, but we'll soon find it. About four onions, just separate onions. Four separate onions. Goodness. Greek style yogurt. Two packs of mixed peppers. Need a lot of peppers this week. Two packs of diced chicken. Unsalted butter for my cupcakes. And speaking about cupcakes, some muffin cases, paper cases. And then for Figaro, I've got her some treats. Got, so I've got her some dense bites, and then I've got her some of these little beef and rabbit sticks. She loves them. Now, how the hell do you say that? Is it mange tout? Mange toot? I don't know. These. <laughs> Here's the pack of more baby potatoes got some beetroot and some mozzarella that's one bag done on to the second bag 12 large eggs um, wholemeal bread Two packs of passata. Some mixed berries. Some beef mints. Some smashed avocado. Two packs of sausages. Some peppermint extract. Some water chestnuts, some rice, oh uh, no, not rice noodles, egg noodles, some dirty fries seasoning, some oyster sauce, some angel delight. Daddy's tomato ketchup, some sweet chilli sauce, and then these are actually pretty decent sized carrots, so five of them, I've got five, pretty decent size, some dark soy sauce, Two tubs of mint chocolate ice cream and then that is the second bag one. Oh, the last one is on the floor but we got a stuffed crust takeaway sweet honey barbecue pizza got some aerial washing tablets got Tins of tuna in spring water. 
Got some after eights for my baking. Got some whiskers food for Figaro. A bottle of milk. Some butter beans. Chinese five spice. Various packs of Pringles. And last but not least, two bottles of Pepsi Max Lime. And that came to nine, um, just over £90, so a bit more than last week, but I think we got a little bit more food than last week, so. But yeah, now to put all this away. Look at it all. It's all on the side. <laughs> into the afternoon now and I'm sorry if you can hear the washing machine and the tumble dryer but we obviously have washing to do and it's not the best weather to take it outside to you know put it on the line so it's just noisy in here at the minute but I need to get this slow cooker recipe in because it takes five hours and it's, a, it's like, two, like nearly two o'clock now so I'm probably not going to have dinner until about seven, half seven in time for the football at eight, but um, yeah. Oh, also, it's England versus Spain in the final. Fingers crossed England win it. Is it coming home? Is it not? Hopefully it is. But anyway, beside that, that's for later on. I am cooking the sausage casserole dish from the Pinch of Nom Easy, Quick and Easy book. I've got a slow cooker here. I've actually got the Mercy Richards slow cooker. Morthy Richards, not Mercy. That one. Um, and it's basically all of these ingredients. I need to chop it, ch chop all these up and stick it in here for five hours. And then I think I have to add the butter beans and a stock pot at the end. Um, and obviously heat them for about 20 minutes so yeah let's get sorted
Right, so put everything in the slow cooker and I've given it a mix and now I just need to add the sausages and then I believe I just need to cook this on high for five hours. I'm just adding the sausages. Put the lid on, Let's turn it on at the plug and then turn it to high and then set a timer um, set timer five hours there we go right guys time to make some mint chocolate cupcakes hopefully they look similar to this so I've got my cupcake cases out in the tray and I've weighed all of the ingredients. So self raisin flour, light brown sugar, butter, cocoa and three eggs. Oh, and then peppermint extract as well. So yeah, it's basically do the butter and the sugar together and then add the flour, cocoa, eggs and peppermint and beat again until smooth and then divide into these 12 cupcake cases very quick simple easy recipe and i love jane patisserie's recipes they're the best but yeah let's get started Right, so that's all the butter and the sugar mixed and now add in the flour, cocoa powder and the eggs. And then beat again until smooth. Right, so that's all that mixed up and now put in this into here. I use a big spoon and a little spoon to scoop into the cupcake cases and make a big mess to be fair but let's do this stage now. Here they are guys. Right, these are ready to go in the oven. So they need to go in the oven for 20 to 22 minutes. So let's do that now. There you go. Right, here are the cupcakes now guys. These have been cooling on this wire, wired rack for about 30 minutes. Now I just need to cut the middle out, stick some icing, like some mint icing in, and then make some actual buttercream icing. Is it buttercream? I'm not too sure. Um, and yeah, make these look fabulous. Right, I've made the icing as like a thick paste. I've de holed all these, so this icing is going to go into each hole, hopefully. <laughs> There we go, a little bit messy, but <laughs> they're coming along great. Now it's just to do this buttercream. So it is butter, it's 200 grams of butter, icing sugar, cocoa powder, peppermint extract, and then the after eights on top. Let's do the icing. Right, made the chocolate mint buttercream now guys, and I've put it in a piping bag. 
So I'm going to pipe this on top of these, which the ice, the mint icing thing seems to have so so yeah, soaked up. I can't get my words out, but hopefully they still taste good. Eek. guys the mint chocolate cupcakes I just love them because they've got an after eight on and they're so chocolatey and minty and delicious right we will have one of those with the like whilst watching the football I think tonight for our dessert can't wait and then I hope my dad enjoys his on I think he's coming on Wednesday so I might um, film that and put that in my what I eat in a week video that will be coming out on Sunday. So yeah, look out for that. Right, this is how the sausage casserole is looking guys. It is done. It's about half seven now. So about half an hour to the football. And yeah, I'm gonna have this, which looks delicious. That's it guys, the Euros is finished and Spain won 2-1. I am gutted because we did have a chance of going to extra time and possibly winning, but Spain was the better team tonight. But anyway, um, throughout the um, match, I've just been tidying the kitchen really like from dinner and my bacon just put my bacon in a little um, or a big uh, bacon tin and that can live on top of the microwave but yeah right I think that's it because other than um, going to bed and probably reading a little bit more of my book that's all I'm gonna do for tonight because it is 10 o'clock <laughs> um, but yeah I hope you uh, I hope you enjoyed this video please like and subscribe to my channel and if you want to see more of what I get up to during the weekend please come back and join along okay see you later bye